All right, hey, what's going on, everyone? It is B. Avery here again for another trailer reaction. Why am I smiling so big? I don't smile as big normally. That's because this is a Marvel trailer. This is Marvel Studios Captain Marvel trailer number two. And I don't even know much about this character. I mean, I know a little bit more possibly than the average person or the average Marvel fan, but I'm not finna sit here and stunt like I'm just some super duper expert on all Captain Marvel. But I am excited. I want to see Captain Marvel. I want to see Marvel. We all thought Jude Law was going to be playing that role, but they just revealed that he's playing something else. And I'm not even familiar with that, but I do know Avengers, Earth Mighty's Heroes. If you want a good taste of Captain Marvel, Marvel, go check that out. Find it. Not Avengers Assemble. Avengers, Earth of Mightiest Heroes. It's an animated film that came, no, animated TV show that came out a long time, well, a few years ago, around like 2010, 2011. But anyway, let me stop talking and uh, go ahead and put on these headphones. I'm very excited and you guys can stop listening to me talk and watch me watch this trailer. I am excited. Here we go. So, scrolls are the bad guys. Yep. Nope. Here. <laughs> oh, okay. Got some. Oh, nice. And you're a Cree, a race of noble warriors. Heroes, noble warrior heroes. <laughs> Just like get it right. <laughs> Pretty cool. Your life began the day it nearly ended. We found you. With no memory, we made you one of us. So you could live longer, stronger, superior. Be honest, you were I guess. reborn. I keep having these memories. Something in my past is the key to all of this. You know how to fly this thing? We'll see. That's a yes or no question. Yes. <laughs> the young Samuel. Would you like to know? I like that. <laughs> what you really are. I think I had a life here. What aren't you telling me? You've come a long way. But you're not as strong as you think. Her hero like that. The Power off. Ah! <laughs> I'm not gonna fight you. That was wrong in the end of I'm gonna Man. end it. <laughs> that looks nice. Man. <laughs> that is nice. Aren't you the cutest little thing? Aren't you cute? And what's your name? Like some big monster. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> I am impressed. I am impressed. Now, like I said, I don't know much about Captain Marvel like that. But I think uh, to all the super duper comic book experts out there, to all my geeks, is that cat like some type of giant mutated monster turns into something like that? I think I heard that before. So let me know down in the comment section below. Um, of course, this... Uh, it's like going up on a roller coaster, you know, for me in this trailer because it started out kind of slow and it got better and better and better as it got to the end, especially with her like powering up and flying around or whatever. I mean, people have been making jokes saying like, oh, OK, Captain Marvel going Super Saiyan. If you don't know what that means, that's in uh, Dragon Ball Z or Dragon Ball lore where a character like powers up. And, you know, in Dragon Ball Z or Dragon Ball, you know, they turn gold and yellow or whatever. And so, uh, but, you know, the thing is, Captain Marvel came, it was created before I believe Dragon Ball Z was. But still, that's just a little reference right there. That's what it reminded me of because I'm a big fan of that show and all that good stuff. Uh, but anyway, it looks freaking good. I'm very surprised with the information they revealed. Uh, well, I don't want to say I'm surprised. Well, yeah, I am surprised with where they're going with the plot, the reveals in this trailer, because somebody was narrating over the trailer just like, you know, hey, we found you. Uh, you didn't have any memory. We gave you new new memories. We made you one of us. You know what I'm saying? I, I would have expected her to not have known that she was uh, given memories. And, you know, she thought that the memory she, memory she had as a Kree warrior uh, hero 
was like, you know, her birthright or her birthplace or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But they're being honest with her. Just like, hey, no, you know, maybe you had something before, but we turned you into this because of X, Y, and Z. So that's very interesting. That is a a, a point of view, a perspective that I didn't think this film was going to go in. But of course, I haven't seen it. So how would I know? But uh, it looks fantastic. Of course, we got Brie Larson, uh, Drew Lawn here. Now, see, on IMDb, they still have him as uh, Walter Lawson Marvell, but at the same time, you know, IMDb is not necessarily 100% accurate before a movie comes out. Um, I forgot the name of the character that I looked up that he was under. And I got to give my friend right here the Marvel Encyclopedia. Uh, I'm not going to spend too much time. I just want to see if I can see something real quick. Okay, Captain America... Where's Captain Marvel? Sharon Carter. Uh, I'm just trying to look real quick to see if I can... Because if I see the name, I'll know who I'm looking for. And I don't think I'm going to find it that quick. So, I'm going to stop looking for it. But I will say uh, we are in store for a treat. Real quick, I have to say this. I have to address this to all the lame losers out there that today and yesterday and whenever that was going to all the Marvel videos and putting down negative comments and down liking the video just because you haven't seen the Avengers 4 trailer. You suck. No one likes you. Go jump off of a bridge or you can pitch a tent in the middle of a highway. Either choice is yours. Uh, I don't know when the Avengers trailer is going to come out. Maybe Wednesday. I hope it does come out because I'm just really excited to see it. And I'm fine with this Captain Marvel trailer. They're like, why are two, mo two trailers coming out before the Avengers 4? Well, as soon as the Avengers 4 trailer comes out, nobody's going to be talking about anything else. You know, so if the A4 trailer came out now, everybody would be talking about that. And then the Captain Marvel uh, trailer comes out after that. Uh, you know, it's going to make a little fart in the wind, but no. So... This should have came first, even though the A4 will uh, submerge this when it does come out. Uh, you know, it doesn't matter. You know, you still want to give this film some attention. Um, and, and then, you know, Captain Marvel most likely is going to be prompted in the Avengers 4 trailer. So that's just like smart marketing to me. Um, but I'm really looking forward to this movie. Uh, that looks so badass with her flying at the end. Directors for this is Anna Bowden and Ryan Fleck. I have no idea who they are. Um, this will be the first film that I've seen of them. Um, so, you know, we're just going to have to see. Um, anything else I want to say? It was a good trailer. I probably should have watched it again, but, you know, hey. But, guys, that is just my opinion for Marvel Studios Captain Marvel trailer number two. What did you think? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did I turn you on? Did I turn you off? Do you agree with me or do you disagree with me? Let me know down in the comment section below. Let's get this conversation going and keep it flowing. If you like this video, go ahead and give me the thumbs up. If you don't, that's fine, but you can still subscribe to my channel. You can also look me up on social media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all that good stuff. It's right there at the bottom of your screen, and I made it very easy easy by providing links to all that good stuff down in the description box below but guys i just want to thank you again for tuning in to my opinion slash review slash reaction for marvel studios captain marvel trailer number two and before you go don't forget that my name is brandon keith avery and that's just my opinion peace